Hey guys, it's Jenny and welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday! I am here with a live sale preview and this one is for the sale that I have with Trisha of Sandy and Auto. We do a weekly Monday sale together and we do alternate channels. So this week we are on my channel. Again, 5.30 p.m. Central. I'm going to give you a sneak peek of several of the items that I'm going to be bringing. I feel like this is going to be a good sneak peek. And spoiler alert, I'm going to bring a murder vase. <laughs> or, yeah, it's a little handkerchief. I'll show you. I'm excited. It's like this weird stuff just finds me, and I'm okay with that. I am absolutely 100% okay with that. But I do have a variety of items, um, so I'm hoping that I have something for everyone <laughs> interested. So let's just get into it. Let me show you some of the items that I'm going to be bringing to this sale. Um, the first item I will show you is this cool pipe. It's long, too. It is long. Um, that probably needs a little bit of, little bit of something. But it is marked Italy on it. Let me see if I can get that to show up because I'm on my phone and it's not going to show up. It is it is marked Italy right there, but I have never found a pipe. <laughs> so I thought this was really cool. Loved the look of it. Loved the look of it. So I'm bringing that to this sale. The next item that I will show you is this awesome Roadrunner. So I had something similar. He long. He long. <laughs> I had something similar to this, and it was a um, letter opener. And it looked exactly like this, did not have this wooden base. So I'm kind of wondering if this is the same thing, just fancy, just on a base. Maybe. It might be. So he is awesome. Um great condition so i am bringing him to this sale i found something that reminds me of sue spezio and it's a raggedy ann doll this is the first one i've ever found ever it's not super old 80 it's done by play school i believe it was 86 87 but it's in great condition did pick it up and i know we do have a lot of raggedy ann and andy collectors in the community but again the ginger maybe think of sue raggedy sue so did pick that up the next item that i will show you is this really cool japan planter and look at that bear like the colors on this and the detail i like how this is cut out and you can see more of um, the woods and stuff behind the bear I thought it was awesome, in great condition as well. It is it is stunning, stunning. It is marked Japan on the bottom, um, but that's it. Not sure, probably a sticker of some sort um, on here, but am bringing that. The next item, I have found a few macrame pieces um, over the last week, um, and I am bringing this little wall hanging and I love how it has the macrame and then it has this really soft, soft um, material yarn. You know, team no craft <laughs> material yarn on here. I thought it was so cool. So I am bringing that. It even has like a little wood peg and a place to, to hang it up. So I am bringing that. Hang on, let me put this back in here. Um, I'm keeping it in a little little bit of plastic so that way um, it doesn't get unraveled. That's what I'm so afraid of. I'm afraid it's going to get unraveled. But to go with the boho theme of that, I have a large wooden mar uh, mushroom. I almost said marshmallow. <laughs> Jen. <laughs> Jen. This large wooden mushroom. I couldn't leave it. I don't think it's old. Um, I really, I really, really don't, but it was too cool. Too cool. I can see this in someone's display. Display. Uh, I can see this with pixies and elves underneath it. I thought that would be really, really cool. So I am bringing that. Okay, I think I'll show you three more items. I have a set of um, metal. I mean, they are metal, but they are squirrels. So I have this one, and then let me get his... 
his little mate. I feel like they match exactly, exactly, but I loved the look of them. I don't think they're supposed to be hugging. I don't know. I don't know, but I thought they were really neat. Um, they are metal um, or an iron of some sort, but I like that. I like the look, so am bringing those. I am also going to bring this rough geode. Oh, you see, oh, it's shiny, it's shiny. Um, I don't know if this is an actual geode um, or not, but I loved the look of it. Um, this is rather rough, so um, it seems natural to me, I don't, but I don't know. I don't know. I just love the look of it, so um, I did pick this up. I'm going to bring it um, and see if anyone is anyone is interested. I, again, I just love the look of it. Alrighty, I'm going to show you the murder vase. Are you ready? <laughs> so cool. It is so cool. <laughs> it is so cool. Does this, especially like these, and like right here, what kind of looks like <laughs> blood spatter, <laughs> which apparently is, is a thing. But in all seriousness, I love the texture on this piece. It is a handkerchief um, style vase, bowl, whatever you would like to use it for. But this almost reminds me of like the lava glaze almost, but... I loved it. I thought it was cool. Please, you guys have to tell me in the comments. <laughs> Are you thinking murder vase? I am. I am. It's really stunning. It is, it's beautiful and it's very well done. So, but yeah, I'm going to be bringing this. That is it, guys. That is all that I'm going to show you for this sneak peek. I really hope you saw something you like because I really, really want to see you for our sale on Monday with myself and Trisha of Sandy and Auto. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you're having a great day, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.